that was Indapur, and now it's time for us to move to the next branch. And for the second uh, category, this for the next uh, team, I would like to now invite AHPS Muzaffarpur, who would be representing Tirupati, uh, Tirupura. So, requesting the branch to please unmute, turn the video on. AHPS Muzaffarpur. I am Nisha Singh, APS 5400, Mujapurpur, Bihar, and we are representing Tripura. In my team, I have Ashish Rana, Manas, Arya, Anjali, and Anya, and all students are from class 6. So, dear jury members, and all the members present here, Fasten your seat belt and be ready to dive into Amazon of India. Over to you, Ashish. Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Ashish Shonak and I am going to introduce Tripura to you. Tripura is a state in the northeast of India. The Chief Minister of Tripura is Sri Manik Shahaji. Tripura is, one of, is the third smallest state in India after Goa and Sikkim. The, border of, uh, Tripura, the national border of Tripura meets uh, Assam and Mizoram uh, at the international border meets Bangladesh. Tripura is also included in the seven sister states along the northeastern states of India. Uh, in this state is the cultural reservoir of all the uh, uh, northeastern states in India. The uh, area of Tripura is covered more than half by forests, in which bamboo and cane plants are the most common. It has heritage and historical sites. Wildlife destination and a thriving arts and crafts industry. Tripura is known as the volatile daughter of Mother Nature. This state is home to 19 indigenous tribes as well as a non tribal Bengali speaking population. Tripura has the highest number of primate species found in any other Indian state. The capital of Tripura is Agartala, which is the second largest city of the northeast. The Ujjwalta Palace, which is an architectural marvel, which the state boasts about. Now, I am going to tell you about the geographical profile of Tripura. Tripura is predominantly a hilly region. Tripura has three distinct physiographic zones, namely hill ranges, undulating plateau, and low-lying alluvials. Tripura is uh, characterized by a warm and humid tropical climate with five distinct seasons, namely summer, monsoon, winter, spring, and uh, winter. Uh, Tripura is well enjoyed with the surface water resources. There are 10 major rivers, which are Barima, Gomati, Khoai, Havra, Longai, Dhalai, Feni, Mohri, Manu, are the major rivers. Now, my friend Anjali will tell you about the amazing history of Tripura. Good afternoon, everyone. Now, I am going to tell you about the history of Tripura. The history of Tripura can be known from the Ragnarok story about the king of Tripura and the account of his king story. According to Ragnarok, Tripura, the rulers of Tripura were called by the surname Pa, which means father. Tripura is considered a very prosperous state because of its history and culture. There are many folklores, mythologies, songs, stories, and the puzzle in the culture there. All the stories are made on the basis of everyday experience in which, in which a description of goddess, god, demon, witch, history, flora, and animal is all seen. A place named Sabiura in Tripura is famous for its wall carving of Lord Vishnu, Lord Shiva, and Mata Durga. Tripura is also mentioned in Mahabharat, many religious Purans and inscriptions found in the time of Ashoka Emperor. In ancient times, Tripura was called Kiradde. From a princely state ruled by Maharajas for over 1300 years, Maharaja Bhim Chandra Mahitya was the first king of Tripura. After the reorganization of the state in the year 1956, it, was, it became a union territory. And in the year 1952, it, it was granted full statehood. Now I'm going to tell you about different tribals of Tripura. Tripura has a rich cultural heritage of 19 different tribal communities. Some of these communities are Vidhi, Kasaiya, Gutya, 
garo chaimal nutia tripuri and kuki tripuris are the largest tribal communities in tripura and each community has its own unique dance and culture which are famous in the country now my question is going to tell you about tripura's traditional attire Good morning, children. This is Manas in front of you. Today, I am standing here to tell about Chipura. Now, my topic is Chipura tradition attire. Chipura has their own traditional dress, similar in style to the to that of North East Indian people. It is, however, different in pattern and design. The lower half of the body is called Rignai. This is Rignai. It wears on the upper half, lower half of the body, and the upper half of the body is is called Risha and Rignai. It wears on the upper half of the body. Now we discuss about languages. In Tripura, there are mainly two languages are spoken: folk rock and Bengali. People use English languages for their official work. Now we discuss about music and dance. Music and dance are most important part of any culture. People use here thumb, which also called dhol, an instrument called smul used here, which also look like a basuri. Dance. The famous dance of Ring people is Hoshagri dance. In that dance, the people dance. Dance the people dance. Now, many types of dance are found in this state, such as Labang dance for Tripuri peoples, Bizu dance for Chakma peoples, Wangla dance for Gara peoples. Now we discuss about heritage culture. Tripura has several diverse Hindu linguistic groups, which has given rise to composite culture. There are around 19 tribes in this state, such as Tripura, Tripuri, Bengali, Manipuri, Kuki, Mizo, Mo, Monda, Uchai, Sinthol, Nekton, and the culture of Tripura is quite rich. Today's Hindu, Muslim, Buddhist, and uh, Christian of the all religion live together in the state. Now we discuss about fair and festival. Fair and festival. The Gadia and Gadia festival are biggest festival of Tripura. The Lord Gadia is worshipped in the form of Lord Shiva. This is a Gadia festival. In that festival, the people tie cloth. in the symbol of lord shiva now we discuss about handicraft tripura is a land of diverse culture race and traditions the people the tripura is known for its bamboo cane products and jewelry products and handlooms mm. Now my fellow mat Ara is going to tell about food habits. Hey everyone! Before we start, before we start uh, introducing the food habit, we are we and my fellow mates are going to sing a Tripura folk song. Ori ami chitla mara kopi manda.
they are less one less than one crore so this is why it is called unna kothi only one five star hotel of tripura there is only one five star hotel in tripura found in agartala one flyover only one flyover there is only one flyover in tripura it is in it is also in agartala in this 51 temples of goddess sati there is a temple in tripureshwari devi if there is a kund pit kund means the tortoise and pit means the lake the lake of the lake of tortoise there is a lake full of tortoise there are more than 100 tortoise we can find that we can make them make them feed we can even touch them thank you now me and my now me and my friends are going to show you godia puja and godia dance participate in kio and we are very proud to participate in this type of event so thank you to all of you come by so that was hps muzaffarpur indeed it was a great performance and it was so great to see you said that you know this is your first participation in kio and believe me you know these are the middle graders all from grade 6 they performed beautifully so i want to congratulate the team you did a fantastic job okay very nice great so now 